Lori Marilyn Pincus was only 21 years old at the time she was murdered. She had recently moved to Toronto from the Ottawa area. She had been working as a sex trade worker in the Bloor and Lansdowne area. Lori was last seen in the early morning hours of Sunday, September 8, 1991, when she left a local bar after having a drink with friends. Later that morning, at about 9.55 a.m., the caretaker of Brockton High School, located at 90 Croatia Street, discovered her partially nude body lying in the school parking lot. She had been assaulted, strangled, and left for dead. A full forensic examination of the scene and the body was conducted. Many persons of interest were developed and eliminated during the course of the original investigation. In 1991, DNA testing was not available, but recently DNA testing was conducted on this case. As a result, a strong male DNA profile was developed. He is currently not in the National DNA Data Bank. Now that we have the killer's DNA, we just need a name to go with it. There is no doubt that there are people that are close with the offender or who were close to him back at the time of this offense, and you know he is responsible for this murder. It has been 26 years that this murderer has escaped justice. This is a killer who left a young woman's body on display in a schoolyard. It is time he is held to account for his despicable actions. If you want to remain anonymous, that is okay. We have his DNA, so all we need from you is his name, nothing more. Bring his name into this investigation so he can be held accountable.